You have to remember um, the owners uh, and the guests that frequent or own yachts um, are billionaires. They expect nothing but the best. Um, their, their expectations of service um, in any other capacity, in their home, at restaurants, at hotels, um, is, is fundamental to, to their life and, the, and their daily, daily visit. They notice everything that isn't there. Um, so the job of the chief steward or stewardess on board um, is to have the finesse to make everything happen without even being noticed. Good morning, Olivia. How are you? Good to see you. Matt, it's nice good to see, see you. you. Andrew, good to see you again. Follow me. Let's go down the side here. Welcome on board. How are you? Look at that. That is spectacular. PYA launched uh, last year um, an interior training and certification platform for our interior crew. Um, to date, uh, the yachting industry has had uh, mandatory requirements and mandatory training for deck and engineers, but nothing for interior crew. Um, and bearing in mind interior crew are the front line to the industry, um, they're the ones that are serving the owners and the guests um, on, on a daily basis. Um, it's quite uh, Amazing that the industry has never had a, an interior training uh, program. Our course is the foundation of we're coming into this industry. Um, so they're not suddenly put in at the deep end. They are taught explicitly and interestingly how to do the job. Uh, we cover all aspects with them and we explain to them in detail. Uh, we explain to them even how to wash up, wipe up. We teach them how to walk out and present themselves to owners. We teach them how to clean bathrooms, uh, do beds, uh, giving them the eye, and the eye for detail, which is very important in this uh, in yachting. So walk towards me and smile, and... Would you like anything to drink, sir? Yes, I'd like a glass of water. That's the correct place to be. She's one metre away from me. She's not crowding me. She's looking me in the eye. It's very important. She's standing with her hands behind her back, or you can bring them to the front. If you look here, so you've left this area, and look, this is not correct. This should be like this. There are some owners on these yachts that have got nothing else to do but to pick holes, and they will do that, and they will see how long it lasts. It's a lucrative industry, so there's always a great deal of people interested to come and work. But really, what you have to understand is that you've got to be a really hard graft. You've got to be a hard worker. You have to have a service at heart and really love to serve people, that can sometimes be difficult. Uh, you've got to be very hygienic, you've got to be well presented, uh, you've got to be quite energetic. They work long hours and, and fairly hard. Well basically I've been in South France now for 10 weeks and struggling to find a job. Since I found out about this course, not only will I be getting more experience, learning new things, they'll also help me out finding the job after the course. So it will definitely be a big advantage. Off you go. and you walk back this way. You never walk in the interior of the yacht. Once service is finished, that's their private home. Keep moving round. That's it. As quickly and as quietly as possible as well. Remember, plenty of pressure and keep holding it as tight and straight as you can. It will just make it easier. When the guests have gone upstairs for dinner or drinks, you will come down and turn the bed down for the evening. So the cushions will go into the cupboard if you want to go and take them, put them away. You take your pillows, that's it, place them on the end of the bed. 
then you will take one side of the bedding with Max. So together, pull it so it's equidistant. Pull together. Max, you're not straight. Make sure it's straight, Max. You've pulled far, that's it, too far over. Rule of thumb is rule of finger. You take the glass, you look, you, like so, and you fill the champagne to that level. Never overfill the glass. It certainly can be a career. They can come in a, a normal position for a stewardess. They're earning around 2,500 euros a month. Everything's found. That's basically their pocket money. Um, and I know some girls that are on seven, 8,000 euros within five years, a month.